Hello Aquarius and welcome to my channel Mind's Eye and Inspiration. This is going to be a reading for you for the month of September 2022. I'd like to say thank you for all the likes and all my new subscribers. I'm really, really grateful for everyone who subscribed, helping me reach my goal of my first 1,000 subscribers. And if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, then please do so, because uh, it's totally free. And that way you won't miss any future videos that I release, particularly if you click that little notification bell. I'm going to put a link in the description box below to my sister's YouTube channel, Anything Spiritual, because she also does monthly readings for each star sign. OK, Aquarius, let's see what's in store for you for September 2022. You've got... Um, money on your mind at the moment you know and so have a lot of people at the moment things are a bit tight but you're in um, a situation where you feel okay Aquarius you know you've worked really really hard and you've been trying to save you've been sorting your finances out um, you know sorting your bills out making sure that you've been tidying your finances up so to speak so you've not got any payments or things going out that you don't need to so you know you're saying you're in a situation at the moment where you're better than uh, than you was last year I feel um you know better than you thought you were going to be so uh you can see that you will be okay you're saying, I will be okay. I've been sorting my finances out. I've started early sorting things out. So I know I'll be okay. You've got the Knight of Swords here. So there may be someone you've got to fend off in September, Aquarius. You've got your sword in the air. You've got some kind of challenge where you have got to protect yourself. You've got to stand up for yourself. Stand up for your family. So there could be some kind of argument or disagreement where you need to look at the bigger picture. It's not about taking sides. It's about looking at the whole situation and looking at it from every perspective and then making your mind up. Not just listening to one side of the story because as we all know, there's two sides to every story. So you need to look at things objectively as a whole and then make your mind up and then act in a way to protect yourself, defend yourself. This could even be involving a family member, Aquarius. So there could be some kind of argument or disagreement within the family and they're going to try and pull you in on it. They're going to try and say, come on, we want you to pick a side. And you're going to be saying, I'm not picking a side. I'm looking at it as a whole picture. I'm not going to take sides, but you may have to defend yourself because they might not like it when you don't pick a side. But you do have something good to celebrate in September. And I do feel this is where your achievements are concerned. This is to do with your career and your finances and your money. I feel that you've got a celebration. I'm just going to pull another card over that. Yes, look, money, security with money. So this is what you're feeling you're in a good place with in September. You're feeling I will be OK. You can see the four corners of this castle and there's a coin in each corner. You will be OK. This person sitting in their property, you know, refusing to spend his money, refusing to leave. 
So this card also does say, you know, you're holding tight on your money, but also deep down, you know that, you know, you are, have been good with your money. You've been spending it wisely. You've been saving, you've been careful and you will be okay. I can see you working really, really hard. But be careful you're not working too hard, Aquarius. Be careful you're not taking on other persons, other people's burdens, other people's workload, other people's problems. Because you need enough time to spend with your family your loved ones, your friends, you need that time to unwind. So, you know, yes, you want to be out there, you want to be earning money so that you've got your little nest egg, you know, you want plenty of money to go around, but don't let other people put on you. Don't be covering all the shifts and doing other all other people's work as well. You know, and this could be as well where you need to stand up for yourself with this uh, disagreement. And you've got the high priestess. That's quite, quite a spiritual, quite an intuitive card. You can see the high priestess. She's looking at herself in the mirror. And she's just like looking at, you know, at me, remembering me. What do I like? What do I want to do? Because the trouble is when you're carrying everybody else's burden, everybody else's load and you're doing all the work and you're having no time for yourself, you forget you, Aquarius. So don't forget you in September. Make sure you've got that equal workload. Make sure you take that time out to sit with nature, sit in the garden, you know, go for seaside walks, whatever it may be, to help you unwind, help you relax, help you feel, like, you know, calm. Make sure you take that time out to spend with your family, friends and loved ones because you do need that time to remember you and what's important to you and be true to yourself, Aquarius. Stand up for yourself, be true to yourself, be true for what you believe is right and wrong. For what, you know, your beliefs. Don't just go along with somebody else because that's easier. No, stand up for yourself and say, hang on a minute. This, this is what I think, this is what I believe and I trust how I feel, I trust my beliefs and I need to stand by how I feel. Okay, I've got the Archangel Oracle cards here, so I'm just going to give those a shuffle and we'll just see Aquarius what we pull for you for September. Gentleness, Archangel Sandalphon. Be very gentle with yourself at this time. Surrend Surround yourself with gentle people, situations and environments. So again, be true to yourself. Be gentle to yourself. Have that time, like we said with the High Priestess card, that time to relax, that time to unwind. You know, gentle music, relaxing music, relaxing times. Just to put that smile back on your face. Just to feel carefree. And it also says by surrounding yourself with gentle people and situations. So remember what I said here before that someone's going to try and pull you in on an argument. And you've got to stand up for yourself and try not to be involved in it. Because you know you don't want to be involved in chaotic, toxic environments. You just want calmness. You just want quietness. You don't need to be involved in other people's arguments or disagreements. So don't get pulled in on that Aquarius. Try to uh, stand back. Put your sword up. Don't, don't be involved. 
you know what you feel and what you believe inside but you don't need to get involved in it it's not your argument to be involved in you just need calmness serenity just that time to yourself okay Aquarius I hope you've enjoyed this reading I hope it's resonated with you and if it has then do leave me a comment in the comments box below do click that like and subscribe button and I hope I'll see you again next month.